so today I came across this video about, and I saw these eight girls, I think two of them, two of them were guarding the door, so it was six, beating up this one girl, I think she was a cheerleader, um, I wanted to talk about it because it's very important, because it's this generation, my generation, and it's the future of America, so I think it's pretty important, so. Um, let's see. Um, the mom was on the Today Show this morning and she was defending her daughter. Which, you know, I can see because she's her daughter, but it still doesn't make it right. Um, I mean, this mom is the real problem for even justifying the beating. I mean, what was the mom thinking? Oh, my daughter beat a kid up. Big deal. No, it's more, it's more, it's a huge deal, you know. You can't, I mean, it, it's in my, it's at my school, it's in my community, I mean, it's everywhere. But, you know, they just don't get noticed, like this one did. Um, but, you know, the girls beat up this one girl to get 15 minutes of fame on YouTube. Yeah, I don't really understand it. Um, America is just turning to crap because this culture has taught children to ignore empathy. And I don't want to see my generation go down like that. I mean, they need to step it up and do something about it. Um... Um, the culture has taught all of us that judgments cannot be made and any behavior is acceptable. And not every behavior is, is acceptable. And it certainly is not acceptable to put on YouTube or MySpace. I mean, the parents tried to blame MySpace and YouTube for their problems, but it wasn't. These girls are just downright sick and have issues, I guess, from a past that they're still mad about. And, you know, they just took it out on this girl. But that's not YouTube or MySpace pro is problems. Um, and, you know, I hope they get what they deserve, which is jail. Lots and lots of jail. You know, I hope the girl recovers okay. I know she had um, brain damage and um, uh, some eye problems and stuff. I don't know all the details, but I wish her the best of luck. And, you know, she's probably going to be traumatized for years. And I just can't imagine what they're going through right now. Um... <clears throat> I also wanted to say, parents, please keep your children in line. I mean, these parents do not know how to handle their children, don't know how to raise them, and they're not doing a very good job. Just please don't let your child have enough privacy to where they're doing things like that. Monitor what they're, on, what they're doing on the computer. Monitor what they're doing at school. Just let them have a little bit of privacy, but not too much, because that's where... America's parents have gone wrong, you know, and that's how kids get into gangs and fights and drugs and everything else, so, please America, just grasp your kids, and, you know, it's making America look terrible, like a trashy country, I mean, we, it's just not, and you know, the ones that don't get noticed, the beatings that don't get noticed, it's everywhere and you know somebody needs to just take charge and do something about it because this can't be repetitive it can't keep repeating at all it needs to stop someone needs to take charge and do something about it 